everybody and welcome back to another episode. I'm a little bit in a rush, so we're gonna go as fast as possible. We are now at the Grand Prix of uh, the Canada. And we had got some, oh Jesus. Uh, we got some monsoon rain uh, situation in the race going on. That's, wow. I've not seen this uh, in my uh, F1 career. That's uh, uh Why can't I select one? Oh man I can select the one I wanted Okay Well we're gonna do the fast train Don't fucking cut the corner like that Don't do it No time Thank you myself not being lost we are lost well, just remind that it's a wet setup just remind that it's a wet setup so I'm now in the mud but when the rain is coming and pouring down maybe I'm not so much in the mud Montreal is not only the second largest French speaking city in the world but it's home since 1978 to the off the back of a fantastic qualifying session, it's time to see how our starting grid looks like for today's race. World champion Max Verstappen starts from pole position, and it's Lewis Hamilton alongside. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Oscar Piastri, Fernando Alonso, Russell, Sainz, Perez, Leclerc, Norris, Albon, Joe, Hulkenberg, Ricardo. Gasly, Bottas, Stroll, Sargent, Ocon, Sonoda, and Golden Boy. Now it's almost time for lights out, so let's go down to the track. A warm welcome to Anthony Davidson, who's beside me in the commentary box All right. today. So we have seen the starting lineup. I'm gonna do the the setup for myself for the strategy. No, mediums is good enough. And I'm hoping mediums are going to the when uh, the rain is coming. And that's the point where I'm. Yeah, a difficult start of the race. On the outside of Tsunoda. Holy fucking moly. Let's push him a little bit to the right and take that 19th spot. Oh Jesus, guys. Get a grip together. And that's P18 because we are on the inside of Logan Sargent. Another easy move. Sergeant also lost a place with Tsunoda. Okay, the start was fine. Let's try and move forward. I'm already moving forward. What are you talking about? Could have wait. Fernando Alonso is out of the race. Okay, oh, there he is. That's definitely a mechanical failure. Green flag. I've no speed. I've no. You know they come straight past me there, like I'm... What? 
Nee jongens, doe nog Nou man. Wel, that's fucking idiot you are. You are an idiot. You are a fucking idiot. Why should you do that a fucking flashback? Delta positive, and let's have you straight to the pit lane, please. Okay, there's been an incident on track resulting in loose debris. Fortunately. Oké, 
I believe that uh, and a great performance from the, the thing has broken team again. To secure victory here in Canada. I have no straight line speed there. They are so slow. Tell me, Ant, how do they manage to achieve Where this win? Finish? Rain oh always has God. the potential to liven up a race and mix up the order. And then... All right. I have no idea. Oh, we got the point. Oh my god, we got a point. I lost a place to Norris. But I gained a place over Perez. Oh man. What a weird race, man. This was the weirdest race I ever done. On this on this game, on every F1 game basically. What the hell happened in this race? <laughs> what did it happen is basically the be best uh, question. That was the weirdest race ever. Five stops in a 50% race. And we got two red flags. This messy race, man. Holy shit. Stop won it for Saints, Piastri, Zhu, Hamilton, Gasly, Albon, Stroll, Norris and myself. That means that Verstappen is going to get a big gap now. Indeed, it's 46 points for uh, Leclerc. The fight for second place is, is very much on. Leclerc, Sainz and Hamilton are uh, battling for that. Then you have to get to Perez on 5th. Norris 6, Piastri 7, 8 is Russell, 9th Alonso and 10th is myself. With another race in the points. Don't know, ask how. Because I can't even, even question. I can't even answer that question. Team standings, Red Bull 1st for Ferrari, Mercedes and McLaren 4. We are in 7th. Gap 2. The fifth place is now 13 points, so I need my teammate to get some more some points. I want to say more, just just points would be great. You got only two points. There's a draw in the race on the rivalry, on the right. Both on two points. So, my goodness, what a race! This has been a. <laughs> Incredible race, I can't lie. Do we got some big major upgrades coming? I want one huge one. That's 
one too much. There you got a big one. Well, let's uh, hope that points uh, available for an uh, for a failure or something. There's three upgrades now. Okay, the sentence pack two is the this has happened. Onze nieuwe onderdelen zijn zonder problemen voltooid. Ze komen voor het volgende right. race weekend op de auto. What does that mean for the car? That means we are still sixth. Ferrari are fifth in the in the list of uh, car performance. They are not upgrading uh, well this season. Ferrari, what are you doing? They are they were second in the start of the season, but they are not upgrading fast enough. For, they got out upgraded by McLaren, Mercedes, and Aston Martin. McLaren is closing the gap to uh, to Red Bull. To be honest, look at look at this. Very uh, small uh, difference uh, between them. Although they say there's a difference uh, there, but. Uh, it's getting closer, but that is uh, the end of this episode, so every time, please l press the like button, subscribe on the channel, follow the channels in the description as well, and then I will see you at the next race, and that's the Red Bull r Ring, and I believe that is a sprint race, but I I'm not even sure about that, is that a sprint race? I believe it is, well, we will gonna see in the next episode, uh, bye bye.